hello friends welcome to my youtube channel so in this video we will discuss some previous year question of numerical ability question which were asked in tcs ninja and we will also discuss some shortcuts so that you can solve the question within the time limit because there is a time constraint okay so as you can see on the screen and uh, the first question so we will start with the easy one and then uh, slowly we will move to the more difficult question okay so uh, this is the first question as you can see on the screen so you can pause the video and you can try it yourself and as you can see this is uh, just uh, you have to find the value but keep in mind that uh, we should solve this in a given time only okay so this is a simple question so i hope all of you might solve okay so see this is very easy so i've just written it down okay so as you can see here these are the numbers so what we will do we will convert this number at first we will try to remove the this uh, decimal value okay so uh, i have written the question here so 217 by 10 to the power 4 and i think it is easy into 318 so i have removed all the decimals values and okay so this is the after removing all the decimals we got something like this now we can easily solve this okay so here you can see 10 to the power 4 so this will cut it so both will be over and this is 100 so just remove this and here also 100 so both will cancel out now now see it is very easy so see never try to do the multiplication do not try to do all the multiplication just try to cancel this out okay so we will first cancel this one that is 53 okay so as you can see 53 will cancel out 318 how many times six times okay so 53 into 6 will be as you can calculate uh, 318 okay so this will cancel 318 and similarly you should directly see that 7 will cancel out 217 so this 7 will cancel out 217 in 31 times okay as you can he see here it will be 31 times okay now 31 will cancel out 155 okay and it will be 5 times 31 into 5 which will which will be 155 okay and as you can see uh, we have cancel out uh, denominator as well as numerator and what we got it is 6 by 5 and 6 by 5 is nothing but 1.2 okay so this will be our answer and i hope this is very easy so this was the first question but uh, make sure you do not do the multiplication at a times try to cancel those and the question is framed in such a manner that most of it will cancel out so this was the first question and it was easy one okay now we will move to the second question so this is the second question try to solve this and uh, you can pause the video and you can try it yourself okay so in this case what we have to do we have to find the value of this question mark what should be placed in the place of question mark okay now move to the solution see okay so to solve this question we have to follow one rule which is called board mass rule and i hope all of you must be aware of this it is called board mass now see board mass rule is nothing now see as you can see here this is an arithmetic operation okay so there are some brackets there are some multiplication division etc so we have to follow this in the board mass rule so at first we will do the operation of bracket board mass rule says that if you have bracket division multiplication then in which order you have to solve so this board mass says that the first we have to solve whatever is in the bracket after that you have to solve power or root then division then multiplication then addition then subtraction okay so we will see in the same manner so at first you have to solve brackets now see we will start from here and it is 8 by something now see before this division we have to solve uh, bracket so we uh, we will see that bracket is one is uh, this is starting bracket and this is ending bracket okay now within bracket you have to move inward and you have to start solving from most inward bracket 
so see this is a first bracket and this is closing here again we will move inside this is the next bracket and it is closing closing here again we will move inside and this is the most innermost bracket so we will start solving from here okay now we are here 2 by 4 into 4 we have to solve this now see in order to solve this there are two methods the first one is we will first do division and whatever we will get the result then we will do multiplication or we will first do multiplication then division okay now how to decide so that we will decide with the help of board mass so board mass says that between between division and multiplication first will be division okay so we will do the same so at first we will divide 2 by 4 okay so we will divide 2 by 4 and then whatever we will got we will do multiplication so 2 by 4 is nothing but 1 by 2 or 0 0.5 okay now we will do the multiplication so 0 0.5 into 4 will be 2 okay so this innermost we have solved and we got a value which is 2 okay now moving to the next again we will see we will see the bracket as i told you we will start from the bracket so the next thing will be the bracket okay so next innermost bracket is this one this curly braces so we will start solving this curly braces now inside this curly braces there are two operations one is plus one is minus so which will should be the first so again see the board mass rule which says that addition will be done first then subtraction so at first we will do the addition so 14 plus 2 we will do not 2 minus 13 so at first 14 plus 2 which is 16 and then minus so 16 minus 3 which is 3 okay so this bracket now we can remove okay so slowly we are getting towards the solution okay now now we will move to the next bracket so it is something like this 8 by something now before division we will have to do the bracket because bracket comes first in the priority so again we have to solve this value now in order to solve this value we have two operation either either first multiplication then uh, subtraction or first subtraction then multiplication now between multiplication and subtraction multiplication should be the first after that subtraction so 2 into 2 which will be 4 and then 4 minus 3 which will be 1 now see we slowly move to the now we can remove this bracket now we got a single value which is 8 by 1 which is 8 okay now 8 equals to 3 by 4 plus something now this we have to find so we can do one thing instead of this question mark put x okay so 8 equals to 3 by 4 plus x therefore x will be 8 minus 3 by 4 8 minus 3 by 4 we will just move 3 by 4 from right hand side to the left hand side and uh, we know that 8 minus 3 by 4 is nothing but 29 by 4 equals to okay so 29 by 4 will be the answer so uh, this option c will be the correct answer okay so i hope many of you uh, uh, might have solved this question if not you have to just follow this rule board mass okay just keep this thing in mind okay so this was our second question and we can easily solve this now moving to the third question a bit difficult you can say but not that much okay so you can pause the video and you can try it yourself okay so what we have to do in this case what we have to do let us move to the solution so in this case we have been given the lcm and hcf of three numbers 48 144 and pr 720 and 24 so three numbers are given 48 144 and p so, which is unknown and we have to find the value okay and the hcf of all these three number is 24 and the lcm of all these three number is 720 so we have to find the least value of p okay so if you think this is a difficult so do not worry so it, we will solve this with the help of two methods so at first we will see using shortcut okay which will save your time then we will see the longer method 
सो द शॉर्टकट सेज दैट वेन एवर वी आर गिवेन एच सी एफ सो एच सी एफ इज नथिंग बट हाइएस्ट कॉमन फैक्टर सो एच सी एफ ऑफ दिस थ्री नंबर्स इज ट्वेंटी फोर सो एच सी एफ ऑलवेज विल डिवाइड दिस थ्री नंबर एज यू कैन सी आई गिवन वन एग्जाम्पल एच सी एफ ऑफ ट्वेल्व एंड फिफ्टीन इज थ्री सो थ्री विल ऑलवेज डिवाइड ट्वेल्व एज वेल एज फिफ्टीन सो एच सी एफ सिंस इट इज अ फैक्टर इट मीन्स इट विल डिवाइड इट्स ऑल दिस नंबर ओके सो वी हैव टू फाइंड पी एंड एच सी एफ इज ट्वेंटी फोर इट मीन्स ट्वेंटी फोर शुड डिवाइड डिवाइड पी मीन्स ट्वेंटी पी शुड बी डिविजल बाई ट्वेंटी फोर नाउ पी कैन बी वन ऑफ दिस फोर सो वी हैव टू सी विच नंबर इज डिविजल बाई ट्वेंटी फोर बिकॉज दैट विल बी द एंसर बिकॉज पी शुड बी डिविजल बाई ट्वेंटी फोर नाउ बाई यूजिंग दिस टेक्निक वी कैन सी दैट वन एटी विल बी रिमूवड बिकॉज वन एटी इज नॉट डिविजल बाई ट्वेंटी फोर सो इट मीन्स डी ऑप्शन विल नॉट बी देयर ओके ओके सो वन ऑप्शन वी हैव रिमूव सो दिस इज कॉल्ड एलिमिनेशन मेथड वेन वी डू नॉट नो द एंसर देन वी कैन रिमूव दिस यूजिंग एलिमिनेशन ओके सो दिस इज अ टाइप ऑफ शॉर्टकट ऑल्सो ओके सो दिस डी हैज बिन रिमूव इट कैन नॉट बी द एंसर नाउ मूविंग टू द एल सी एम नाउ एल सी एम सेज दैट इट इज लीस्ट कॉमन मल्टीपल और लोवेस्ट कॉमन मल्टीपल सो एल सी एम इज ऑलवेज द मल्टीपल ऑफ दिस थ्री विल बी मल्टीपल ऑफ दिस थ्री ओके सो एल सी एम इज सेवन ट्वेंटी इट मीन्स इट शुड बी मल्टीपल ऑफ फोर्टी एट वन फोर्टी फोर एंड पी ओके सो इट मीन्स वॉट एवर विल बी द पी इट शुड बी मल्टीपल ऑफ सेवन ट्वेंटी शुड बी मल्टीपल ऑफ पी नाउ सपोज बाई यूजिंग दिस टेक्निक वी कैन सी वी कैन से दैट वन नाइन्टी टू कैन नॉट बी द एंसर बिकॉज वन नाइन्टी टू इज सेवन ट्वेंटी इज नॉट अ मल्टीपल ऑफ वन नाइन्टी टू सो दिस ऑल्सो विल नॉट बी अवर एंसर सो ए एंड डी हैज बिन रिमूव नाउ रिमेनिंग इज वन ट्वेंटी एंड थ्री सिक्सटी नाउ बिटवीन वन ट्वेंटी एंड थ्री सिक्सटी वी विल स्टार्ट विद द लीस्ट वैल्यू बिकॉज इट इज सेंग दैट फाइन द लीस्ट वैल्यू ऑफ पी ओके सो वी विल वी हैव गॉट वन ऑप्शन वन ट्वेंटी नाउ वी कैन डू वन थिंग वी कैन पुट वन ट्वेंटी हियर एंड वी कैन चेक वेदर एल सी एम इज सेवन ट्वेंटी एंड एच सी एफ इज ट्वेंटी फोर और नॉट ओके एंड बाई पुटिंग वन ट्वेंटी यू कैन सी दैट फोर्टी एट वन फोर्टी फोर एंड वन ट्वेंटी इफ यू टेक इट मीन्स देयर एल सी एम इज सेवन ट्वेंटी एंड देयर एच सी एफ इज ट्वेंटी फोर सो डायरेक्टली वी कैन से वन ट्वेंटी विल बी दवर एंसर बिकॉज इवन इफ थ्री सिक्सटी विल ऑल्सो सेटिस्फाई this thing but we want the least value so this will be the answer so this was the shortcut method okay now moving to the step by step so as i have told you hcf will always divide its whatever number are there so if hcf is 24 it means p should be a multiple of 24 so we have written p equals to 24 times k okay now lcm is 720 so what we have done we have taken the lcm of 44 and 144 48 and 144 which is 144 okay so lcm of this two is 144 and this three these three are 720 so it means and we have we have seen that 144 into 5 equals to 720 so if we do 144 into 5 so there comes 720 so it says that number should have 5 as a factor so see by taking lcm of this two number we got 144 but we want 720 it means p should have 5 as a factor then only 144 into 5 will be 720 so we got two things p should be 24 times something and 5 should be a factor of p so we can directly conclude that p equals to 24 into k into 5 because 5 should be a factor and by doing that we got 120 into k okay so 120 into k could be many values but we want the minimum so let us put k equals to 1 so we will get the answer at 120 so this was the method i hope you understood if you do not if you could not understand you can watch the video again uh, still you have a doubt then you can write in the comment section okay so this was all from my side and to get uh, more questions like that you can subscribe to my channel thank you thank you guys take care